I have this big old box full of some brand new skates that I'm gonna unbox for you guys. Impala was so kind enough to send me their brand new skate. And this skate has been in the works for like four years already. I haven't done an Impala skate review in a while, but these are supposed to be their new and improved version. So I'm excited about that. So let me try to open this box. Ow. It has a lot of packaging. Ooh, look at those colors. Did I do it like a casserole? Oh, wait, can you see it? Does it look cool? Oh. Yeah, it looks cool. Yes, Melly, that's you. Hey. They got the brown girl with the purple hair. We stand. So I got the Impala Samira Quad Skate in Wild Pink. These run for $259 with 95 cents. So it is a higher price jump than the original Impalas, which are known for being like $100 max. Oh, they have this really cute paw print that says vegan friendly. There's a car coming. My ass crack is out. <laughs> really? They're gonna see everything. <laughs> so the Samira skate comes in two colors. It comes in the pink one, and it also comes in a baby blue one, which is actually made out of suede. So for this version of the Impala skate, they did introduce suede into their skates, which some people were upset about because Impala has been an all vegan brand like since it started. Some people are happy that they introduced suede because it does last longer. So it's just kind of like, you know, but I chose a vegan one. So that's what we're gonna be unboxing today. Okay, so let's open her up. Ooh, this is so cute. It looks like a Coraline sweater in the other world. What is this? An extended warranty? Impala's for everyone. Welcome to the Impala Skate Squad. Okay, wow. Did they kind of match my outfit? Ah. Damn, they're so light pink. I feel like I don't remember them being this light. But they're so cute. Look at this plate. We finally got an adjustable toe stop. It was pretty like sturdy too. And then these wheels are so much bigger than the original Pause. wheels. I need like a good angle. <laughs> Look at these little stars on the truck. How freaking cute. And they have these same stars on their inline skates, like right here in the boot. And then look at this. The ankle is so much higher, taller. And then it has this like really comfortable, flexy, sporty. You know what this reminds me of? Like pool floaties, like little kids. Um like swimmer that comes with floaties. But the tongue is very squishy too. It has this meshy tongue, which I think is gonna help when like your feet get really hot. So I think that's a really cool upgrade. Okay, these laces seem a lot thicker. I feel like Impala was known for like little like skimpy laces, but these are pretty good. And it has this little squishy thing. What is this, like a charm? Can I take the insole out? Pretty squishy. Told me that they did make a new insole, so that's this. I wonder if it's like heat moldable, like a lot of them are. So they adjust your feet. It's paper in here, no wonder I'm struggling. Here's this baby. So cute. Melly, do you like these colors? Yes. <laughs> yeah, they're like very Barbie. Yes, and the Barbie movie is coming out. I'm so excited. I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie okay, did they give me a tool though? Oh. So there's no tool in here, which is a bummer because I know that they made a new tool specifically for this skate because of the adjustable toe stop. But I'm gonna check. The toe stop feels pretty tight. And it's like pretty close to the ground too, so. That's really good for like when you're a beginner. Comes with this manual, so cute. Here's the manual. Just telling you how to adjust your trucks. And like I said, this is their old skate tool and this is the new one. Yep, that's what you're gonna need. It tells you how to tie your laces if you really don't know how. How to stand up. 
I really like this. How to bend your knees so you are perfectly balanced. I wonder if Maddie did these drawings. Tells you how to do some stops. This is so cute. And then it's in French, Portuguese, Dutch, Espanol. Los patines están diseñados para ser utilizados en superficies listas sin arena ni suciedad. Latina. Oye, mami. So I think if this was my first pair of skates ever and I was super excited to start to learn how to roller skate, I would read this like a million times. Like I just skimmed through it, but the information in here is really valuable and I just think it's so good that they did this. They're so informative. Okay, so we're moving locations and I realized that they have this thing. This is so convenient and most other skates don't have these except the jack boots. So I'm gonna be using these to see how long they last because I have seen a lot of people rip the ones that their jack boots come with, so. Interesting, they don't even feel that heavy. Okay, so I actually brought my other tool and I'm gonna make sure that all the wheels are spinning so I can try them on. They're not like super hard like a lot of the stock skates, but I'm just gonna loosen it a little bit. Oh my god, it's hard. I think they're like perfect. Hold up. Yeah, they're pretty perfect. <laughs> okay, shit. First time. All right, let's put these babies on. I'm so excited. I feel like I'm gonna go really fast. And we're in a park that has like a lot of hills. So pray for us. I got my socks with sandals cause no free toes. And the Impala skate sock. These are the new socks. I think they're really cute. Okay. Ooh. This tongue is like really cozy. Wait, why did the lace get all tiny? Okay, I don't like that at all. <laughs> what? I'm so used to skate, less, skate laces being so long. Okay, that's kind of annoying, but oh well. They feel, so I got these in a size six and I've always been a size six in Impala. I'm usually like a, in a regular skate or men's skate size, I'm a four. So these do not feel, they feel maybe like a tiny bit big but comfortable and they're not squeezing my toes which I love they do feel roomier than like the other ones like right here I feel like there's more space and this like leather is like so soft vegan leather Damn, this tongue feels really good <laughs> <laughs> like you know like the beach bunny tongue that's like really hard and like I don't know like does not fold at all this is like the complete opposite. Oh my God, but I hate these laces. I hate them, officially. Cause what is that? Whoa, these trucks. Whoa, these trucks. Where should I go? These wheels feel really nice though. I love these wheels. Ooh. This truck feels weird. This one right here. But look, I can go over these cracks like nothing. Oh, 
Whoa. These toe stops are so low. Yeah, you can like stop right away. So, so far, I feel like my front trucks are a little bit too loose. So I'm gonna tighten those just a bit with my skate tool. And you don't even have to take your skate off for this. You can just... Just a couple of turns. Ducks are right there. Go to the ducks? Yes. Okay, let's see if that made a difference. Oh yeah. So better. Yeah. <laughs> we used to have a duck. His name was Pepe, and then my dog killed it, sadly. We dug it him. up. No, because I just tied in the front tracks and I feel so much more balanced. <gasps> I really like these. And they don't hurt my feet so far. They don't hurt my feet. Like, I don't know, there's just a sponginess to them. Oh shit. <laughs> Walk for me, serve. Walk for me, serve. Walk for me, serve. Walk for me, serve. Cook, 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 Toe stop check. Pretty good. Fun fact, I used to play tennis here. So, if anyone wants to play tennis with me, hit me up, because I have no more tennis friends. I don't have skate friends. But we could skate and play tennis too, so. Hit me up. Shit. We have to go slow around here. Look at it. Low key, this foot is starting to hurt a little bit. But I think it might just be the seam of my sock. But it is starting to hurt a little bit. POV, you take me on a date to the. What is that? La Mirada shit park. Mm. I'm being a Facebook mom. It is.
I love being next to water. It's so calming, except these birds are telling me to shut up. My sister and I have been skating around this park for a good minute now, trying to break in the new skates. I think the biggest difference I noticed is the wheels. Like when I saw them, I noticed that they were bigger, thicker. I don't know, they just look like a like the big moxie gummy wheels, but not that gummy. But I've been, there's a lot of really big cracks here and I have just been rolling over them with little to no problems. So I really like that. I do feel really stable in these skates. I like the adjustable toe stop. It's been helping me stop really well. And again, this park does have a bunch of hills. So having a good toe stop is really good. I'm also impressed with the fact that the toe stop was bolted on like perfectly, like really, in there so not gonna slip out or anything and then the wheels were also like tightened perfectly they weren't so tight that they barely moved they were like perfectly i tried to adjust them but i was just putting them back into their original spot the only pain i'm feeling so far is like right here but i'm also noticing that i kind of didn't tighten it all the way really tighten them if you let them a little bit loose and you have your foot kind of just like moving around it might it will cause pain and blisters and yeah i just don't like the side, the length of these laces i wish they were much longer but i love the color because it like totally matches them but i know that skate shops have like other like cute pink even like a sparkly hot pink lace that you can probably put on if you are also having this issue i might change them i might not i can see how i'm trying to break them in here this is where it folds and then again the ankle is pretty tall but very comfortable this whole area is very comfortable this is super comfortable i love this yeah i cannot wait to keep skating these i have been needing a new outdoor skate since my sure grips ripped and i also feel like a lot of people are going to be on the lookout to see if the heel lifts from these skates because that was a big problem coming from impala skates was that the heel was lifting but these are supposed to be extra reinforced and they are extra money wise so i really hope that the heel stays intact in these but oh my god there's a bunch of geese coming oh my god <laughs> So yeah, I will keep you guys updated though. I really think I'm gonna be using these a lot because I've been trying to skate, street skate more. And I love that they're pink. Pink Loki has always been my favorite color, but I went through like my emo phase and I was like, I don't wanna wear pink. But now I'm reclaiming that and I'm wearing pink and I'm being girly because I love it. And if you don't like it and that's not your cup of tea, then that's okay. But I love it and I love to my makeup. So I hope you enjoyed this unboxing and try on of the new Impala Samira Skate, the pink vegan one. If you guys enjoyed this video and you are not subscribed yet, please subscribe to my channel and become a baby carrot. And if you would like to see other content, then you can follow me on Instagram and on TikTok at Karen the Carrot, where I post more different things here and way more often than on YouTube. But I'm always gonna be on YouTube. You can't get rid of me! If you would like to buy these skates, you can do so at pigeonskates.com and use my code CARROT. Put it right here. That is CARROT with a K and all capital letters. And yeah, hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye!